Hello, everyone, and welcome to uh, 8-Bit Adventures Game Night. We are playing Fire Emblem Three Houses. And uh, what we have going on right now is uh, it is the 26th of Wyvern Moon, which is basically October. Um, right before uh, the the Battle of the War or the Battle of the Eagle and Lion. Um, So this is kind of like my last weekend to do what I want. Um, but uh, we're going to be doing some battling. So, and I know that is basically what 79% of people have opted to do for this uh, for this weekend. Uh, I think it's a sensible choice. Um, I do have some battling quests that I can do. As well as some... Um, this uh, green exclamation point signifies a prologue quest. So, that's something that I'll probably end up doing. Um, so, uh, we're going to get right into it. So, I think first off... Um, yeah, I think we're just, we're just going to go ahead and do this, this paralogue. So, um, this is for Lorenz. Um, he receives a letter from his father, Count Gloucester, who wishes for his son to resolve a territorial dispute that is about to escalate to violence. I have a feeling um, it's not just going to be escalating to violence uh, that we're going to get there perhaps a bit too late. And uh, who knows? So. Ah, oh, perfection. Oh, these tea leaves are just divine. Quite the impressive select. Uh, full so disclosure, uh, I cannot stand Lawrence. Um, I think zero. he's a creep. Lured here by the exquisite aroma. Uh, no? I've got a thing for you. It's a letter. All right, well, don't say I didn't deliver it. A letter for me. Nobody really likes him. <laughs> Let's see what we have here. Hello, Professor. It is a rare correspondence from my father, as it happens. Some difficulty with Acheron, apparently. My father wishes me to return home and settle it. A young lord whose domain borders my father's. Do you know of the Great Bridge of Murden? It is an old bridge across the Aramid River, a key crossing between Alliance and Empire territory. Acheron controls the land on the northern side. Yeah, if, if your name is Acheron, uh, that, that's a bad sign. Controlling such an essential location gives him quite a bit of clout, which he is ever so eager to deploy toward the purpose of stirring up trouble. This time, he is dredging up an old border dispute that was supposed to be settled some time ago. He has even begun to dispatch military force. It is best we route his troops before they cause any damage to the surrounding villages. To my father, Acheron is insignificant in the face of far other houses wield far greater power and influence. Goneril, Ordelia, Edmund, and of course, Regan. To make his voice heard at the round table conferences, my father must keep up relations with them. That is simply the way the Leicester Alliance works. It was, after all, founded with the goal of freedom from Fargus. We prize that independence highly, even if it occasionally hinders cooperation. There is often talk of mutual aid, but the truth is that each noble acts to maximize personal benefit. At hmm. the moment, the Regan dukedom is in no state to keep those conflicting motivations in check. So while the Alliance may appear to be at peace, the reality is that internal conflict is a routine matter. Of course, this leaves me precious little time to sit back and enjoy a cup of tea. Alas, I must be off. Yeah, good luck. <laughs> Since you're here, perhaps you would care to accompany me on this... Oh, I, I no suppose. Acheron, ...but it could be valuable for you to experience these political nuances firsthand. The fate of the Alliance will someday rest upon my shoulders. No, it won't. So it is important to me that those I deal with understand its workings. What say you to broadening your horizons? Yeah, yeah. Excellent. Let us be away so, uh, I picked the, the, uh, the Golden Deer for hands. my my route. Uh, so, Lawrence is a member of the Golden Deer. Um, they are the Alliance. So it's a loose sort of uh, group of city-states that have all banded together uh, instead of forming like a traditional kingdom. I am grateful. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
You can have your mysterious edge lord black eagles. <laughs> Alright. Let's see y'all. Um Do I want to swap somebody out? I actually I think at this point I can probably Oh, you know what? Let's uh let's sell off that bullion. Bernadetta's got. Um, and you know what? We should. Is that the oh, wait. No, we don't want to sell that. Come back soon. Whoop. Don't want to do that. Um, we do want to do... And... Yeah, we'll just do that. And then, uh... Let's see, is there any lances? Not really, but that's fine. Don't care about lances. Um, and then we'll swap units. Uh, Ignatz, uh, he's pretty well set. Um, he's, he's basically primed up and ready to, to become an assassin. So, uh, I want to focus on some of my lower uh, level units here with uh, Dorothea, Bernadetta, and Flane. Although Flane, like, she... Oh, is she an adjutant? Oh. That's why she's getting all sorts of benefits. Got it. I was trying to figure that out as to why, like, she was just randomly getting experience points and stuff like that from... Uh, me doing all sorts of stuff. Oh, so, okay. So that's cool, that's cool. Um, I just want to make sure. Increases might based on units missing hit points. Yeah, no, let's, uh, let's trade that out for Night Kneeler. Um, there we go. There, now we're now we're good to go. Yes. Defeat the enemy con commander 12 turns pass. Okay. Far more enemies than I expected. I am glad you Where is the defended location? Oh, and here I thought Count Glossop Oh my god. <laughs> soldiers here. This is the guy This is Acheron? Ah, well, oh. it doesn't I'll Come on. <laughs> that guy looks like Terry and Darrington. That is Acheron. We can deal with him. That ought to scare the rest of these rats off. We need not actually kill him. So long as we cut his escape off convincingly enough, that should suffice. Incidentally, take note of those drawbridges. They can only be... Okay. We may be able to use that to our advantage. Yeah, so honestly, with a bunch of my archers. Okay, where's where's Dorothea? There's Dorothea. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start this off. So Dorothea has um a a bunch of monks that she can activate to give everybody like super big movement bonuses. Um So I'm going to do that. When I mean super big movement Thank bonuses, I mean, it it's like uh, rolling around at the speed of sound this. here. And there is nothing more terrifying than a heavily armored dude with an axe uh, rolling around at the speed of sound. <laughs> Uh, this also means oh, I have super. Oh, okay. Hill doesn't actually have the movement benefit, but that's all right. Let's get to it. Oh no. 
stay focused. All right, I suppose I should sort of the crater. Only that I should level up my sword skill. Uh, I have been doing what I normally do. Um, so in this game, it really wants your main character to wield swords. Uh, and I usually think, no, I want to be an archer. So I've been trying to level up my bow skill. It hasn't been going over very well. Um, Ready and, willing. and so uh, I, I have decided to actually switch back and uh, use a sword like the game intended me to. I mean, yeah, I, I have no shortage of archers, because uh, right now I have Claude, I have Bernadetta. Um, uh, Leone, I think I'm going to make her a bow knight, so she'll be a mounted archer. Um, and then as far as other ranged characters, I've got Lysithia, who's a great mage. Um, Marianne can also uh, do range support. Um, so I, like, I have no shortage of, of, <laughs> of ranged characters. It's just like... But I want to be an archer too. Leave it to me. Um, all right, so we got we got a bunch of folks over there that we're gonna need to defend against. Ugh. That will not do. Um, can I get him? Nope, don't want to do that. I stand ready. Archer guy over there. All right, we can do this. I don't really like the relic sword. A trivial victory. Uh, and particularly the fact that it just, like, has, um, that pretty much the only way to restore its durability is by resting, which seems like a waste. Like, there, there is never a time in which I want to just do nothing. Um, Pony. Marianne, where where can she go? She's just gonna go here. Yeah, but I haven't gotten any of the special ore. Um, we're gonna silence that guy. No spells for you this turn. You know, we'll move Lysithia here. Um, yeah, I feel like I'll move Hilda, like, up on the battle mode? Sometimes. Oh boy. That's right. You got nothing. I think not. You got nothing either. <laughs> I've uh so Raphael is my big uh super armored uh axe guy and uh, I am Ooh. well alright I guess it's time to break out that divine pulse what is this 
What is even happening? Am I able to do Divine Pulse? I see. Okay, so let's go. Oh, I guess I needed to go back one more. Um. Oh, that's great. I never use it, so we'll do this instead. That's safer. Okay, so that's that's pretty interesting. We're still gonna silence that guy. Leave it to me. You know what, we'll go here instead and pick up that item. So that's that's a really interesting mechanic. I thought it was just like it goes back like three turns or something. I didn't realize that you you specify how far you go back. That is amazing. Uh, and it is also the power of the Monado. <laughs> what? You missed Lawrence? So are those, I guess those merchant ones are also melee, um, cause I have some of those, um, battalion core <clears throat> where, where they load poison barrels. <laughs> I'm like, I don't feel very comfortable with this. Like that is, that's some, like that's some, uh, that's some like forsaken nonsense right there. I can't do that. That's, that's wrong. That is categorically wrong. Okay, uh, so we gotta we gotta do stuff with Dorothea. Um, but what exactly can we do? Um, I I don't know. We also need to get Bernadetta in there to get some experience points. So um, I think we go here. And we just start wiping people out. I don't I don't like this flying person all the way back. I don't like that. Um Ready and willing. The good news is <laughs> Kerplunk. Although, now that I think about it, uh I did have uh, an interaction with Claude where he basically made poison and was just like, hey, you know, it's funny. <laughs> it's fine. Um, will Nosferatu do the job? Yeah, well, I need to raise my faith skill in order to uh, unlock some new classes. Uh, uh, I wonder if I should move Raphael back up top. Um, I stand ready. Oh, that's definitely what I, I should heal Lawrence. Oh! You're 
outclassed. Um, move. Assist. Regain all your hit points. Because... Those are really powerful. Um, is there anybody over here? Just those weird guys. I got this. Oh, I can't Stay actually focused. bridge. Combat arts. Smite. Nice. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, that's so fantastic. Um Ugh. I don't like that. Jeez. I can't move her anywhere. There we go. Nice. Um, you know what? I think Hilda needs to not go that way. Ooh, there's an archer there. That's not good. Um, these guys have it pretty well handled. So we'll just use Hilda to pick up items. Um, I'm going to send that to the convoy. And poor Dorothea. She gives everybody else super mega movement speed, but has no super mega movement speed of her own, so... She often can't get to the party once, uh, once the party starts. She's got a lance equipped? Why did I do that? Oh, do it. Nice. Plenty more where that came from. I won. Oh, that's right. Leone's, uh, Leone's a paladin now. She's not just cavalry. Excellent. Okay. Um, alright, so we need to take care of this first. Let's get rid of this flyer. Anywhere I can hide. Um... Can't get that far. Um, I think we have me open up a path for Raphael. Should I have held back? I think we send Lysithia down here. Yeah, this is fine. He'll be okay. He should be okay. Alright, Hilda. Uh, I'll manage. Okay. So that definitely uh, informs things. You're 
really tough. Yeah, we don't we don't want lances. We want axes. Sorry, did I hurt you? So we're gonna turn Hilda into a wyvern lord. What is that? Oh, it's an archer. Okay, Lawrence. Um, I think we move Lawrence into this bush here. I think we move Dorothea. Let's move her here. I want to get that experience. Have you found some thieves? Do not allow them to escape. No damage. Get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What's next? That's fine. Let's turn the tables. Okay. Oh, that's that works. Um, let's do... One of these. Magnificent. <gasps> Advanced seal! Yes! Oh, there we go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I, I need those. All right, then. sword. Okay. So, how far can she get? She can get here. We'll do this. Um, I'll attack with a sword. I need to increase my sword skill. The glory of progress. Bane of monsters. Hmm. Fading blue. I, mean, I could smite and just eh. Hmm. Yeah, we'll take those. There we go. Okay, so we got these folks up here. So we have an archer down there. I don't like that. Um, let Leone take care of that problem. Let's get to it. You know what? We're gonna gambit. I've got another option. 
Another one down. Have her draw fire. Um, got another archer there. Dead eye. Fifty percent. Let's try it. You can do it. Nope. <laughs> But it gives me bow experience. Nice try. Yeah. yeah. I'll celebrate later. Really, dude? It was a good try. Got nothing. Ooh, a brawler, dude. How vexing. Wow. This isn't what I... No. Well then. Um. I'm close enough to the end of this. I don't know if I'll go back. To I mean, I do have one more use of it. I might as well make it. How do you like that? I don't know. Do units the enemy like is on the move? Do not let them through. Yeah, we'll use it. All right, so we will go back to there. Leave it to me. Here's what we're going to do. All right. Stay focused. As expected. The glory. Man, I really can't get there. Um. I gotta keep like get away from there. Stupid flying units. Um Pony. Let's get to it. It's time. I call that a win. Me? Yeah, we're gonna go over here. Support that way. No. Oh, we gotta do it this time. Can I go now? There we go. Totally worth going back for that. To do for Lysithia. I guess we just wait there. <clears throat> Sorry, but victory is mine. Brawling dude. Here's the plan.
And that's right. Yeah, it's all right. We got this. Should I have held back? A bit just. Good to go. Oh, that's right. I can use warps. <laughs> I'll use warp next turn. Uh, that's my other favorite combo with Raphael, is to uh, cast warp on him, and then that allows him to simply just go anywhere. Uh, giving your big bruisers kind of uh, just free reign to move fully about the battlefield is fantastic. Estimate an outsider. Okay. Um, I stand ready. We'll go here. Oh no. Underestimate us. <laughs> Another one down. Yeah, I've been uh, I've just been skipping them entirely with uh, Everything is red, a trivial victory. like that. Do 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 do. Okay, we're gonna see. Thirty-eight percent chance. It's still worth you? it. Splitter. Uh, wait, I lose. I give up. I surrender. Please don't kill me. Yeah, this guy's totally Terry and Darrington. You have my thanks, Professor. Please go on ahead. I will clean up here and then report to my father. See you back at the monastery. Gloucester Knights. Ooh. Ooh. That seems nifty. I'm guessing since uh your assistance in this incident with Acheron has proved most essential, since Lawrence is in your, thanks to you, a cavalier to nip this should probably in the bud. I should probably give him uh give him that battalion. He's written a pledge to my father, swearing never to cause trouble about the border again. Of course, he is hardly the type to bind himself in but Acheron has many connections, both in the alliance and in the empire. To remove him entirely would cause more conflict. Indeed. I do plan to eliminate him eventually, however. He is nothing but trouble. Incidentally, there was one other benefit to embarking upon this errand. Have a look at this. The Magic Staff Thursis. 
A relic passed down through House Gloucester for generations. What? It seems my father has finally recognized my ability. What? Apparently, he had been considering entrusting this relic to me for some time. What? He has had precious few opportunities to take to the field of battle personally of late. Doubtless, by giving this to me, he what? intends to send the message that I must work even harder. I will certainly continue to do my utmost, but I am by no means completely... I would not go so far as that. But my father seldom thinks beyond the immediate benefit of our house. While that is important, I prefer to consider the greater good when I make decisions. I believe that is a noble's duty. Now, for the time being, may I trust you to decide how we may best make use of Thursus? For the moment, I think you are in the best position to apply it to the betterment of all Fodlan. To be quite honest, I'm not certain I feel ready to decide the fate of a relic on my own just yet. Do me this favor, Professor, and I will be grateful. Ah. Uh, what? <laughs> Magic attack range plus two may have damage. Um. Well. <laughs> well. Um. Uh, I guess that's going to Lysithia. Because. Holy moly. Also, I'm totally going to give that accuracy ring to burn E, and I'll give the iron shield <clears throat> to Lysithia. Oh, I can't I can't do both. Okay. Well, I'll store that then. Yeah, so it gives me plus 10 hits, so that way uh, Deadeye should be more accurate then. Um, holy moly. Uh, Bane of Monsters. That's the Might plus 6. Crit plus 10. Hit plus 0. Ugh. <sighs> <laughs> oh, right. I can't use a shield. <laughs> well, then. Oh, battalions. Um, Where's where's Lawrence? Lawrence. Sort by default. Gloucester Knights. Oh! Oh, they're really good. <laughs> I mean, they're really good. Um, and can't use them. What's my, what's my rating? I can't use them either. Uh, Claude totally can. Because Claude is totally, holy moly, that's a really good, yeah, it's, um, I've been trying to, trying to work that in, um, yeah, we're gonna swap that out, merchant military, there we go, yeah, detonate toxic barrel to inflict on foes in the area. <laughs> Yeah, that's the only thing, is I really like the protection bonuses that the soldiers give me. And I don't know who would benefit. Oh, Hilda needs one. It seems... Oh, that's right. Hilda needs... 
Hilda needs a Pegasus core. So I need to I need to level up her uh, her authority. So that way I can uh, give her the Pegasus Knight or the Pegasus core. You know what? We're gonna give Bernie one of these merchant militaries. Um Oh, they reduce physical attack by one? I mean Saros mercenaries would be great. Yeah, we'll give her one of those. Um Yeah. Oh, and you know what? Since I have a new one, I'm gonna give I'm gonna put model leader. Endurance takes half damage. Um you know what? We'll swap out HP for model leader. Okay. I don't think we picked up any bullion or anything. Um, so what do we got here? Gold. Um, let's just do a regular. Oh, you know what? Uh, wait. No. Yeah, let's just do a, a standard auxiliary battle. And I figure I'll probably just end up doing doing combat for this stream. Um, I have found that I really need uh, <laughs> I really need the smithing stones, um, as well as money. Welcome. Okay. Um. Oh, that's right. Oh, I have I have seals. I have seals. Um. Oh, that's what I want to do. Replenish. Yeah, I needed to do that, I think, before. Yeah. Yeah, I needed to do that before. Uh... That's fine. So, let's see. What does the map look like? Okay. Frontal assault looks like. They'll probably try and flank, but that's fine. Where is Dorothea? Dorothea's there. So I could do this and go that way. Alright. Route the enemy. That's my cue. Alright, everybody. Time to party. That helps. Do do, do 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 Really? Man. I stand ready. Reduces movement. Well, <laughs> guess it's a good thing I did then. Holy moly. Leave it to me. Wow. That's that's quite a distance. Except flyers and casters. That's weird. I guess it worked out. Oh no. Who me? Any archers down this way? 
Nope. Just a steel axe to the face. There we go. So yeah, Deadeye normally gives you a penalty to hit, but uh, by canceling out that penalty, basically. Stay focused. I will auto heal because I don't care. Uh, <laughs> I can do it again. Yeah, let's uh, let's let's. It's weird because, like, the positioning is real tricky. I'm sorry. All right. So now that we got this. Your guys gotta go. Right, he's got ranged capabilities. You just can't stop him. He cannot be contained. Helm splitter. I put in some work. Yep. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> Still got my little hatchet equipped. That's okay. Without any archers left, um, it's going to be real tough for these guys. Okay. Good point. Can we help? I should I should okay. use my gambits. So good. Okay. Uh, Hill doesn't have any, so whatever. Nice. There we go. I can improve too, you know. <laughs> oh, poor horse people. Oh, they're really they're really not doing well. Um oh, I can't gambit. Me too. In this situation. This is what I do. I don't have Bullion. Yeah, I guess I'll clean this up. Those two aren't moving anywhere. They're like, no, nah, I'm, I'm out. Oh, he can move down here. Which means he can attack there. Oh, it's a little road. 
I didn't realize that. Oh, I could have used that to my advantage. No. Oh. Nice. Um, you know what? I think it's still worth it. She's got good defenses. Come on, bring it. You got nothing. Another one down. Can't get comfortable. Bring it. I said bring it. I'll celebrate later. And I believe that's it. Ooh, Black Sand Steel. Ooh, I can make my bows and the longbows with that. And other stuff. But, like, really, that's the cool one. Because longbows have extra range. So, like, give give uh, Bernadetta a longbow. And... Poof, longbow, Deadeye, and make her an archer. Range for days. Um... I think I'd want to do one of the quests. Um, and let's, uh, let's... Ah, I can't do that from here. Um, prepare. Uh, quests. What does this give me? Remire Militia Kingdom Youths. Ceremonial Sword. Smoke Meat. This one gives me more renown, so let's go with this one. Kind of ore. Just says ore. We'll go with this one. Thank you so much. Thank you. Megan was not following me before? What? I am so confused. I am... <laughs> Indeed. Yeah. Yeah, if there was ever a Nani moment, uh, that right there is it. <laughs> oh, I should give that Devil Sword to somebody. Oh, cool, and Thursus does not have durability. Uh, anything else to sell? No. Um. Oh. Knights of Saros. Brawlers. Disturbance. Lure. Knights of Saros. Um... Yeah. Come back soon. So what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, transfer, uh, transfer stuff. Um. Yeah, you know what? Let's let's give me the devil sword. Store that. Got any weird stuff? Uh, got rusted lance. Store that.
store that. Um, I store that one. Oh, she needs a lance. G give this girl a lance. I need to store the sword. Who's who's got too many lances? You can totally spare one lance. Um. Okay, I think we're good now. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna take a steel sword for Dorothea. Okay, uh, and we didn't get any new stuff there. Okay, let's check the map. Let's see. Okay, oh, it's this map. All right. All right, all right, all right. Um, so archers. Where are any archers? I don't... No archers. Okay, so Hilda can go run amok. Um, she can just go run amok. Uh, okay, experience points there. So I want to move Dorothea or Bernadetta over here. Um, and then items just up the corridor. Okay. We good. Oof. I'm going to turn fan on. It was waiting on me. Let's see. Just gotta plug in this fan. It's a little, little, uh, little toasty in here. Okay. Um. Oh no. Oh, I can't get there. I got this. Man, I just Let's get to it. can't get there. All right. Mm, that seems I stand ready. There we go. It's in Lawrence in there. Um. Yeah, we'll do a game. Oh, it didn't work. <gasps> There we go. Draw the attacks there. chance to grow we must all do our part that's my cue Levin sword <laughs> winning's always nice yeah I got I got cool stuff. <laughs> okay, so now I'm pretty sure 
a lot of my units can go do whatever. Um, We'll have Claude go back and grab this item. Blink. Just worked harder. Okay. So now I'll send. We'll send. Uh, we'll send Leone up. Here. So Lawrence there to give Leone a boost. This is what we'll do. I think that's I think movement repositioning abilities are super cool. Um and then it's just Hilda. Oh. No, we're going to we're going to snag this item up here. Really cool. <laughs> Take care of that. I do actually really like the animations sometimes. Okay, I'm sorry, students, but uh, look, Professor needs sword experience. Okay, so should I have held back? I I need to go through and just like route. Uh, and. Dorothea needs sword experience as well. Hey, I got you to train better. Um, do 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 do. One, really? Oh, you know why? I should have moved Warren's up. Wasn't thinking. Ooh. Ooh. Is that only... Can I only target adjacent people with warp? Yeah. Warp is a great spell. Trivial victory. I thought I.
Yeah, they didn't want to attack Leone at all. Do it, Bernie. I thought it was dead. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. Combat arts. Why can I not cast something? Can I only do it once? Maybe I can only do it once. Uh, which, that makes me sad, but it's understandable. Alright, we're gonna put Hilda up here. Claude goes in the woods. go. There we go. Do 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 Battle a chance to grow. Incoming. Watch this. You underestimated me. Um, who should get up there? Oh, we all in the back. Dead up. You lost to me. Yeah, more renown. Uh, so what renown does is I can use it at various statues and kind of refurbish the statues, which give me uh, essentially bonus experience so when improving much. skills. So it's when teaching students, and I think when training myself, uh, so much. it uh, it gives like bonus experience. Um, yes, and as Josh says, uh, in New Game Plus, you can essentially use it as currency for everything. Special dish in the dining hall. Partake in the festivities. Um, oh no. Um, if I partake in the festivities, do I miss out on 
the mission? Okay. Alright. Oh, hey, two of my favorite people. Also, I love how it's, uh... Oh, no, I guess it's War and the Lion. Or the Eagle and the Lion, so... That smell. Mm, it's amazing. Thank you so much. There we go. Kingdom Youths. So we'll have to see. Uh... All right. What exactly? What exactly do Kingdom Youths do? Um. Also, who's got bullion? The convoy does not have bullion. However, blacksmith, we can forge. We cannot. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Okay. Um, so smithing stone. Then what I like to do is I like to sell training equipment. And some of the, uh, like, just iron quality stuff. Um, I guess that's it as far as training equipment. Which, that's fine. Um, I'm going to sell this shield as well. There we go. Just for some quick cash. Um, oh, support. Holy moly. I'll do that off stream. Um, there we go, battalions. Kingdom youths, youths from the kingdom. Uh, okay. I don't really seem to do a whole lot. I I don't know how I feel about it. Um, what's my rank? So, rank D. Alliance Magic Core. We are going to do Merchant Military on, on him. Um, these guys are maxed out. Um, you know what? We're gonna do Merchant Military on Ignatz as well. Eventually, I will get better stuff. Um, okay. So, here's what we can also do. Um, oh, actually. Darn. Okay. So, I guess I only have one advanced certification. So, I need to decide who gets to advance. Um, so, Raphael uh, Lysithia could... Marianne could. Hilda could. Um, Dorothea could. Ooh. 
What one could I do? Oh, assassin. <laughs> I could be an assassin. Um, Claude could become a sniper. Oh, this is tough. I can only pick one. I can only pick one. Um. Oh, Bernadette is already an archer. Okay. Oh, Dorothea would just go to intermediate. So let's let's do that. Mercenary, thief, or mage. Um. I think giving her black magic would probably work. Would probably be better. Although, I know... Actually, yeah, let's see what stat changes we get. I mean, that does work out pretty well. Well, we'll have her take the mercenary exam. And I'm pretty sure she can just also take the, the mage exam as well. So this, folks, is how you change, how you unlock new classes and change new classes, is your students actually have to pass an exam. Um, yes, we will do that. Okay, so so she only take one exam certification per day. Um, no, Leone's good. Warlock. Eh. All right, here's what I think. I think, um, okay, so I think we hold off on Lysithia. Uh, Marianne could totally become a bishop right now. I think, though, yeah, I, I think Hilda, maybe? Which, which, uh, kind of surprised with. Nah. Nah, we have, we have Raphael, uh, turn into super tank. I mean, that is, that is some straight up monster hunter armor right there. Yes. Um, and yeah, I think we actually, yeah, we have Lysithia take the priest exam. <laughs> we switch her over to being a priest Perfect. for a while. And then she continues to... Yeah, I mean, she'll still use uh, Black Mage abilities, um, but just to work on that until she qualifies for Warlock. And then the idea is to eventually make her a uh, Grimori, and then she just uses all kinds of magic. Uh, Marianne will become a bishop, 
and then eventually a Holy Knight. Hilda will make a Wyvern Lord. That'll probably be the next one, because she's ready for it. Um, so yeah. I think that's it, because... Yeah. So, I'm going to save it here, and then uh, that's going to be it. Yeah, it's, um, I was thinking about making, uh, Mariana Grimori as well, um, but she naturally has, um, like, she gets bonus to learning riding, uh, and lances, I think. I think lance is, like, one of her, um, like, secret skills, so I was like, oh, well, yeah, Holy Knight makes total sense then, so, yeah, let's do that, and then you'll be a highly mobile, uh, a healer, which will be awesome. Um, and then I'll just have uh, uh, Lysithia be like my super mage, uh, which I'm totally fine with. Mm. Um, I mean, I'm kind of almost there. Uh, it's because um, I have no doubt Lysithia will get there. Um, Marianne has stands a good chance of getting there. Um, Leone stands a good chance of getting there. She's already got the riding and lance skills um, for bow knight. She just needs the bow skill, which, again, is one of her natural skills. So she gets bonuses to that. I honestly, I don't think my main character is going to get to master classes because I was stubborn and wanted to, wanted to be a bow guy. So, um, but yeah. Thank you for joining me, folks, for this episode of 8-Bit Adventures Game Night. Uh, if you would like to see more content from 8-Bit Adventures, check out 8bitadventures.com. Uh, and if you would like to help support that content, um, you can do that a number of ways. One is uh, you can become a subscriber of this channel right here. Um, either standard subscription or Twitch Prime subscriptions. Um, I, as far as I know, emotes. I think emotes are still pending emotes are still pending uh, so they haven't been approved yet um, but they are coming um, or you can become a patron at patreon.com slash 8bit adventures uh, becoming a patron get cool things like exclusive comics early access to content and other cool stuff um, patron exclusives like that uh, let's see next stream is tomorrow 7pm eastern daylight time for tales of Jamora: the kraken's wake uh, it's our D&D stream that we do on a bi-weekly basis. And uh, there will be all sorts of shenanigans happening tomorrow, I'm, I'm sure. Um, I really have no idea what to expect from from the players. So, uh, and then on Monday, there will be an art stream. And then on Wednesday, there will be uh, the 8-Bit Adventures podcast. Um, so, yeah think that about wraps everything up so without further ado have fun everyone happy gaming and enjoy your pie cake golden deer forever there's my there it is <laughs>